Let's render an object in 3ds Max. Start by clicking on the Render Setup button in the toolbar. You can also find this menu under the Rendering menu. A couple areas that we want to look at. Time Output. You can leave it set to Single if you just want to render a single frame, or you can set up a time segment to render an animation. Output size. For most of the single animations, we'll use 1920 by 1080 to get high resolution. Finally, render output. We want to specify a file to output to. Click on the File button. You want to specify the location. We'll put it in our documents. And save as type. For most images, we'll either render out a JPEG or a ping image. Remember, use the naming convention when you name your file. Click the Save button. OK on any specifics to your particular type of file. Make sure you have the viewport selected that you want to render, and click the Render button. After the object is done rendering, you should be able to go to the location that you specified and find the completed rendered object. Make sure to open up that file and check to make sure everything turned out correctly.